All right, Shalom, Markham. First and foremost, all praise to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai. Double honest to our elders, the apostles of Great Millstone, and honest to you brothers who are out there doing the work in sincerity and in truth. Uh, we almost out of here, man. The Lord will, we endure it to the end. We will be worthy of that honor. And uh, basically, this is on 100% truth, man. You got a lot of these clowns, they get mad at us for having 100% truth for teaching 100% truth. You know, what, what you mad at, man? You have nothing to be mad about. You're mad because you don't have 100% truth and we have it? Or you don't want anybody to have 100% truth? What, what, what is it, man? Either way, I'm finna uh, get into the scriptures about that. And you got this, uh, um, that idiot, Bata, um, and, and big boy that he with. Well, what's one thing they like to say? How you got 100% truth without 100% books? I mean, y'all don't even know what 100% truth is, man. Because you, you don't even... I, look at what y'all teach, man. Jesus mean earth pig. The, the, the... Latinos, Hispanics, and Native Americans are, are not uh are not uh Israelites. And before they started saying that, big dude was Reuben. He was a Reubenite. So that means you're not an Israelite, man. And Bata was supposed to be a Gadite. Exactly. So that means he's not an Israelite. But now they black. All of a sudden, I, I assume. You guys are clowns, man. And the most high done took the spirit away from IUIC, from, from IUBK, from whatever y'all want to call yourself, and, and the rest of you other groups out there, man. If you ain't teaching what Great Millstone teaching, because Great Millstone teaches the full, untampered, 100% truth, you going off, man. Time, I mean, pretty much just if you keep up with the videos and keep up with what's going on in Israel, time has proven it over and over and over again. Who got the truth and who don't? It ain't no other group out there who teach it. All right, this is uh, 1 John chapter 2, verse 19. They went out from us, but they were not of us. For if they had been of us, they would no doubt have continued with us, but they went out that they might be made manifest that they were not all of us. Now, the reason why I got that scripture is because you got, basically it's saying the guys who so-called fell out the truth, they never had the truth in the first place. They were never the elect in the first place. They were never with us. And they never had 100% truth in the first place, man. They were just an imposter in there taking up space until the Lord was ready to remove them. Until he was ready to make an example of them and make it manifest. Like a lot of guys that, that your brothers who in the faith done seen fall out time and time again, man. But ye have an unction from the Holy One and ye know all things. All right? It says you know all things. That's a hundred percent true. When you have an unction from the Holy One. So if you you are of the elect and, and you got this truth, this word, you know all things. If I can make a quick point out. Go ahead, bro. The reason why y'all don't believe in one person or one group having one hundred percent truth, because basically the most high took the spirit of understanding from you. See yeah. if you don't have the spirit of understanding, you will get crossed over in the scriptures, man. Mm. That's why you'll say something stupid like how can you have 100% truth if you don't got 100% books? We don't need 100% books. Right, and what is truth? What is truth? You, see, here at Great Millstone, we look up words. We know the meaning of words. Truth, you know what a lie is, right? So everything that we say is true. The history we bring out is true. When we go into the scriptures, it's true. What we saying, 
But <laughs> you're saying even on top of that, we're teaching, we, we still can't have the truth. We still don't have 100% truth. You people are uh, 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 idiots, man. You're buffoons. Verse 21. I have not written unto you because ye know not the truth, but because ye know it. And then no lie is of the truth. So if no lies are the truth, that means everything that we say is the truth, man. Including this video right now. And a lot of you assholes out there, excuse my language, but you get upset. You get upset at the fact that 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 uh we prosper in the faith of Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shah, man. Why are you upset at us prospering in the faith, man? You the same uh type people just like the wicked Pharisees, man. You you didn't want uh you couldn't get into the kingdom of heaven, nor did you suffer the other ones to go in uh either, man. Who the door was open for. So you, you spend all your goddamn time not making videos edifying people, but you spend all your damn time making videos dedicated to a great millstone and trying to debunk everything that we got going on, man. Go ahead, man. Go ahead. And for you niggas in IUIC, go take the motherfucking chip, man. Nobody give a... Take it in your left hand, nigga. Take that shit, man. Give a fuck about y'all, man. Let the blind lead the goddamn blind, man. That, that fucking, that, that nigga Nate, man. I don't, man, I got a problem with Nate, man. I don't like Nate. Cause when I was fucking 17, man, Nate tried to make me buy a book, man. Though when I first came into the truth, man, tried to make me buy a motherfucking book to learn Revelations. Fuck Nate, man. And fuck IUIC, man. Damn sellouts. And you emotional ass niggas. You pussy just like them women who uh, be out on y'all comment boards. You know, I ain't gonna even get into them. But still, take the chip, man. Cause they, he, he wanna talk shit. He wanna call us bums. He wanna, he wanna say what we saying ain't true. Find out if it ain't true. Find out. If it ain't true, then goddamn it. Find out. And if we are right, what does that mean for you? That means no kingdom of heaven for you at all, man. That means you done. You are done, man. You're not supposed to get nothing put in your skin anyway. But guess what? They gonna make you take the chip, man. Cause Nate like money. Nate and that woman that he with like money, man. That's why his woman was on the cover of the book, Understand This With Our Readers. With her damn breast out. Better wake up, man. Either way, nothing that I just said was a lie, man. It's all the truth. So what does that mean? I'm speaking 100% truth, man. All right, and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get First Timothy chapter five because I don't want to go on too long. Uh, verse 21. I charge thee before Yahweh and the Lord Yahweh Shai and the elect angels that thou observe these things without preferring one before another, doing nothing by partiality. Man. What does that mean by partiality? You don't do a damn thing by partiality, man. Ever heard of saying, go hard or go home? So if you're doing this truth, you're doing this truth uh, uh, full-fledged, man. 100% truth. You ain't leaving no parts out of it. When do you hear Nate them get up on uh, America getting destroyed? When do you hear the full spectrum of truth come from any of these other guys, man? You never do, man. But guess what, Gray Millstone, you hear the full spectrum. You hear about these people, you hear about these women, you hear about America, you hear about Esau, you hear about the Illuminati, you hear about Chip, you hear about everything, man. The full spectrum of the truth. The demons, the angels, everything, man. Prophecies, whatever. I could go on and on and on. 
but you get the point, man. This a hundred percent truth, whether you niggas like it or not, man. You know, and what you got this Sakari nigga? You a bitch too, man. That's what you are. <laughs> I see a lot of bitch ass niggas uh, around uh, Israel, man. And the reason why I use the term bitch ass nigga, I use it very seriously because you act like a woman, man. You act like a shameless woman. Shameless women act like you, man. Walking around on goddamn YouTube making comments, man. Somebody tell you better repent, then your response is, well, they better repent for saying this about me. That's something the bitches say, man. You'll be arguing with your woman and you'll be like, the fuck you come in the house so late for? You came in the house late last week? That, that's something the bitch do, man. Bring up something you did when they're in the wrong, man. You in the motherfucking wrong, somebody tell you to repent, and instead of like, yeah, I was wrong. No, well, they would they better repent for bearing false witness. And that's why a lot of you bitch made niggas gonna get destroyed, man. Lord ain't dealing with you niggas, man. Lord ain't dealing with you niggas. Lord damn sure ain't dealing with no IUIC, man. And he damn sure ain't dealing with the sisters in IUIC. This is what's gonna happen to you sisters in IUIC. If the Lord see fit and y'all look fine enough and the man ain't worthy, that nigga gonna get taken out. Then the most high gonna take your fine ass and give you to a real man of the Lord, all right? If he wants you. Or you just gonna get your ass destroyed in America, man. And that's pretty much y'all destiny, man. You ain't got no motherfucker say so. And you ain't gonna have none in, uh, in uh, the kingdom. And you damn sure ain't gonna have none when it's Isaiah 4 and 1 time, man. Damn sure. The man gonna be the prize of everything. You can let Nate fool you motherfuckers all you want to, man. But anyway, I wanna give all praise to you. How about Shem Yahushai? Uh, double honors to our elders, the Apostle Great Millstone, who faithfully doing the work consistently in the winters, the summers, and all seasons, and the brothers who are out there doing the work right along with us, who do the same thing consistently in all seasons, man. Lord will, this video was edifying to you, brothers. Um, and with that, Yahweh Hashem, Yahweh Shabbat Shalom, Amaki.